Hello, everybody! This is Beetle G. Welcome back to Storybook Brawl. Uh, I, I always do this. I, I should start this queue up before I launch the game. But we're here now. Uh, it's been a couple days since I've played. I've been playing a lot of Watch Dogs 2, which has been sitting in my library forever. And I'm very excited. This is a great game. Who? Why did no one tell me? And, uh, yeah, so it's been a few days since I've played this. I did play a couple warm-up games earlier today, and I think I got second place each time. So it's going a little bit better. I'm 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 learning what works and what doesn't. I I have learned an important lesson, and that's that uh, puff puffs are not a very good, not very good to use. I'm gonna try Wonderwaddle. We bought them for a reason, though the fates doesn't look too bad. Um, yeah, so. Puff Puffs weren't great because they don't scale very quickly. You can at most get plus seven, plus seven. I'm sure they work with certain heroes and stuff, and maybe if I got better treasures, but the way I was playing it, which is just pull Puff Puffs, does not work. Uh, so, we are Wonder Waddle. We only need two of animals. I For some reason, I don't like the Rainbow Unicorn. Let's take the 2-2. Two -two. We'll cast a spell. Um, I could lock here. I'm not going to. There's nothing super good. Dragon's fine. Golden chicken's fine. This spell is fine. <laughs> we actually kind of want a cheaper spell so we can do buy a unit and cast a cheap spell. Uh, just like this, yeah. So there are no animals. Let's take the ranged and I guess give it plus one. Right, that gives them both plus one. If there's actually a pretty good chance we don't win this one. Maybe we do the princess first so it has a chance to attack. I think that's that's the play. So if we get to attack with this, AKA if we attack first. I actually don't know how it determines who attacks first. I know there's a treasure that does it. Like you always get to attack first. But other than that, I, I know in Hearthstone, it was whoever had mo more creatures got to attack first. Luckily, we did it. <laughs> I'll pick up another one of those. I'll give them another plus one. We're, for, we're foregoing a unit if we give it plus one. I don't think we should do that. I'm, I'm thinking we might take... We'll, we'll just take this. It's an animal, so we have a chance to get a... Treasure. If we get if, if we get a couple, like, cheap early treasures, we should be in business. That should be pretty decent. Oh, I want to see what that looks like. Ah, it's, it's invisible. It's a green cup. <laughs> oh, we should win this pretty easily. Yep. Uh, we're not even going to lose anything. Anything else. <laughs> uh, we have gotten something. Oh, we leveled up to level three. All right. Characters in your shop have plus one. When one of your monsters dies, give it plus two attack permanently. I think I'd rather do fairy tale. Give plus one, plus one. So when we buy that, yeah. Five, four with the sleigh. We can put these back here. And then uh, we're good. We haven't cast a lot of spells, but we're not we're not going all in on Wizards Familiar. Uh, it would have been nice though. We could sell like something to cast it. It's it's not worth it, I don't think. So this is nice. We should be able to get this leveled up in like three battles, pretty much. We're going to lose this one pretty pretty hard. Oh, my God. <laughs> Not much we could have done there. But that is a pretty rough hit. Ooh, I like Cinderella. I also like Romeo because we have this princess, which will be upgraded. Romeo isn't isn't Arthur. I, I thought it was uh, Prince Arthur. But let's... Oh, there's a lot I want from this shop. I want I want all of it, pretty much. 
Um, let's take both the jewel, the the Romeos. So I, I'm thinking we don't want too many level two treasures. Like obviously we'd be able to then pick the three best ones, but this potentially sets us, sets us up pretty well if um if we find a jewel yet. And if we find a an Arthur, then we almost have that three. We'll have the leveled up quest princess. Oh, there it is. We want that. I think we're going to win this one. It's looking pretty good. Beautiful. Ow. We lost quite a bit, but that's okay. We, we did win overall. These are all garbage. I could just cast a random spell. I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll. It says peep is fine. We only have one evil. Hmm. Blind mice is really good with waddle. Uh, this is an animal, so it's decent with waddle. I'd rather play that over that. We can put like that. I feel pretty good with this board. Unfortunately, this isn't, like, working towards anything. We don't have any scaling, which is really important to get. Queen of Hearts is okay. It can carry you to the late game. But, again, we don't have any evil characters. I'm hoping we can finish this blind mouse. Sorry. Um, finish the blind mouse, and then we'll be able to uh, get a level 4 treasure. That might give us a direction to start heading. We are in a little bit of trouble, but it looks like we're going to win. Okay. That was pretty close. There's the Juliet. Oh, okay. This is really good. I think we're going to hold on to these for a while. We'll level that up. We'll buy Juliet. We could take the Frog Prince. Hmm. Okay. So we want, we want those to die later. We want Princess Juliet. I'm surprised the Brave Princess hasn't killed three, three enemies yet. <laughs> In fact, she's only killed one. Maybe we can put her back here. Hmm. Yeah, and this way the White Stag can buff it. I guess we're going to roll. Oh. I'm going to sell the 4-6. We'll buy this. Your animals are plus one, plus one, and have good. Three and lower have plus one, plus one. Let's do that. That buffs pretty much our whole board. When you buy or summon an animal, give it plus two. This is really strong. I'm going to lock for that. That can be... That can be something we build around. Of course, we don't have that many animals right now, so... Not that great. I'm kind of just riding this Juliet high for a little bit. That should carry us quite a bit. Till late game for sure. Because especially with both of the Romeos. Uh, when one dies, summons a huge old Juliet. Okay. When you buy or summon an animal. We're going to buy that for now. We do have a lot of good characters. I don't know. I don't know how good Fairy Godmother is. We'll cast this for free. This is a good way to buff people. But who are we buffing? Okay, this is a little bit of a hedge. So I'm thinking. Uh, <laughs> I'm thinking we get this brave princess done this round. We sell Brave Princess, put Riverwish here, get this guy here so he can start getting a little bit bigger, um, getting more attack, and we'll look for like some bow peeps to summon animals, and then also just have Juliet and Romeo. <laughs> it's it's not a good plan, but I think it should at least get us top four for sure. I feel confident saying that because we're already almost there. <laughs> 
Ah, yes. So this guy's going with dwarves, and he looks like he has a pretty good setup. And we're getting some really terrible attacks. Okay. That's good. We're done with Brave Princess. We can get rid of her now. Okay. Big old Juliet. That's beautiful. Okay. Big upgrade. Ranged characters have plus three, plus three. We do have the two good ranged. First character is plus ten attack. Next time you pick a treasure, your cho choice is two levels higher. We take treasure map because if we can, um, if we can get uh, Ro Juliet I, or Romeo, I guess that's still a, a tier five junk thing. Okay. We'll eat that. We're probably gonna sell blind mice here after we uh, <laughs> get a little six. When you buy a spell, cast it twice. When one of your character's attacks give it plus five, plus five. At the start of each brawl, your character's attack and health both become the highest of the two. Everybody's health and attack are relatively similar. I think I'm going to go with the uh, plus five, plus five for attack. Wand of Weirding can be good. But, uh, okay. So we're going to do this. Um... This was a very poorly played turn, but I think we're fine. We're gonna kill this guy. <laughs> he is not long for this world. Okay. We bought a couple characters, so, or a couple animals, so this guy does have more than zero HP. Also, the I think the plus five on attack is helping a significant amount. I won't I won't deny that. <laughs> All right, we'll, we'll be able to ride this for sure. Uh, let's just look. Turn an evil character good. We don't even have any evil characters. We're gonna keep on looking here. Cupid is good. It's not an animal or anything. That up. This is a pretty good animal. Let's sell the blind mice. We'll buy that. I think we're selling these princesses. We're, we're off that plan. Oh, the vulture was a really good animal. It's it's fine. It's fine. Okay, that upgrade is pretty cool. Each brawl give your first character that dies plus four plus four permanently. Kind of like that. And we'll we'll get rid of the fairy tale. We don't mind stuff being a little smaller when we buy it. We will lock that for sure. Um, and we'll put this in because when that dies, that. Okay. If we can buff it up, that'll be great. Oh, we will maybe be able to with the plus five, plus five. Okay. I think we're going to win this one too. Yeah, with the with the Juliet, it's rarely a question, I think. Okay. This is looking good. We're top four now. It counts as a win. We get fairy dust no matter what. I, we're already doing better than the first video I recorded. I remember how poorly that went. <laughs> Uh, both players' characters plus five attack. We don't want any of these. We'll just take two gold. Am I scared because that makes our turn a lot quicker? Yes. Or a lot longer. It's, it's a little upsetting. Um, I don't know what we're looking for. Uh, we're going to transform. Uh, we're going to hold. I, I maybe should have bought a five. And, and upgraded it. Bad Moon is tempting. Uh, yeah, we're going to take it, actually. We're going to put that in place of Shepherd's Sling. That should maybe let the River Wish buff those guys up pretty quick. Uh, we're running out of time here. That's fantastic. We want that in. Okay. Now I think we should just be buying a bunch of uh, animals to make those guys bigger. 
if we can get Bo Peep or the cats or these animals, these uh, sheep and wolf's clothings, that could be good. Ooh. Oh. I don't think he's gotten a slay trigger in forever. <laughs> oh, this is going really poorly. Okay. So you can see, like, some of these people scale insanely. I did pick my... Pick what we're doing way too late. Baby Bear is fantastic. Alright. Ooh, I hope that didn't mess up the recording. It probably did. <laughs> uh, so we put this up here. We put this in place of that. We do something like... That. That. It might be time to get rid of Juliet. It kind of sucks, but... Um, she isn't doing much for our... Our plan. I don't think that was a great use of that. It's fine. We could take another Romeo. Ah. <sighs> it's really not good. But I'm tempted. I'm tempted. Okay. We'll lock for this. 14, 14. I think we sell this by the blind mice. That buffs them up. Uh, it gives us... We can sell this or we can hold it to try and get another four. Level four treasure. There's also... I think there's a level five character that says like plus two, plus two to all animals. And whenever you summon an animal, it. I, I think we're looking for that. If If we don't die in the meantime. Okay. This really is fine because they're buffing these guys permanently. We're scaling just slowly. <laughs> it might be time to get rid of the River Wish. I, she hasn't really done much. Okay. We might still be able to win this. I think it's working. Yes, because we summon a huge, huge old Juliet. This guy might be dead. No, he gained life. I locked for this. Okay. I don't know about giving them 1-1. One, one. Does not seem that great. But I'm going to do it. Uh, let's keep rolling. We need to find stuff. This is an animal. I'm going to buy it. Okay, I think River Wish, you might be gone. This is two... Five? Five animals dying? That gives us 15-15. Not going to have much attack. Oh, oh, it gets plus three, plus three. That got to be a slight bigger. Something like that. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. <laughs> mm, they're huge. They're so big. Oh my god. Give your dwarves plus two plus two for each dwarf you have. Yeah, that triply is going to carry him. We're taking a lot of damage here. Well, good job, Potion Master. Whiskey. Oh, we're not dead. But we're getting there. Oh, my God. Uh, Echo Wood is so good. Okay, so it's time. It's time. We're getting rid of this stuff. And we buy Echo Wood. We buy this. Um, That there, that there. Wombat in disguise, maybe later. We'll, four damage probably isn't good enough. There's a blind mice. Summon an additional. Replicator or hidden cash? I think reduplicator because we aren't going to be playing that many more rounds. <laughs> um, the good treant. But um, it's literally a good tree. 
<laughs> All right, so this is looking risky. I wish we could buff her attack a lot more. Right now, she'll get a bunch of HP, but no. Oh, right. She gets a ton from Spear of Achilles. So every single one, every single time one of our things attacks, she gets huge. So this might be what we were looking for. It might be a little too late. And it's unfortunate that this guy is also running a really good dwarf build. Am I supposed to learn something from this? Are dwarves really good? Hmm. I don't want to believe it. Yikes. Ah. Uh, all right. Third place, I can live with that. Um Man. That was tough. I I think I think we were on the right track. I think we got to it a little too late. Now let me check. Uh I you know, I think that's a good place to call it a day. I'll be back tomorrow with some probably void bastards, but I'll be playing more of this. Don't you worry. In 2 days come back. See you guys then. Bye.